Hello everyone and welcome back to our Eden burning scenario. Well, 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 well. We are building a dam right now, isn't that right? This is completely right. It's taking us some time. So we already have all the timber in. We almost have all the bricks in. We still need quite a few tools there. And by the way, also these 600 honolers that are working on this dam right now. It's costing me dearly, so we are really down on workforce. I cannot clear up any other ruins because of that, because basically we would lose more and more um, workforce to other things. And as we can see here, we're losing air quality though right now. So this is a bit harsh um, as we can see. And I need to be careful of what I want. Of course, the two factories are needed at the moment. There we have those two ruins there still that I would really like to clear up. And then we have, of course, the brick factories that, well, basically because we need bricks, it's costing us at the moment i just have to wait here right now we do have these two ruins then that i would like to clear afterwards i've built another forester oh, yeah. hut here or a lumberjack hut here and here because we probably will clear up this forest there to make connection with that village there no idea about that but it is likely i think while we wait, let's continue with the next we quest. We requested some essential scientific papers from the Royal Academy of Environmental Sciences. But the captain of the courier ship is demanding a fee before he'll hand them over. I hate to ask, but could you buy him off? I knew you wouldn't turn on us. Sail to Yakoska's harbor. Alright, let's try this one. I hope we don't need to get anything with us. I don't think so. So let's get our frigate that we have and only that frigate over. Meanwhile, some under other lumberjack huts here so are soon. empty, so oh, no more trees. So I'm going to delete them so to not cause any additional need that we have there. And deliver Forget the fee. Class. Where should we deliver it? Oh! Oh, there is something down here after all. So let's get us a ship down. And there is actually something here. Perforian shipwrecks, so I guess we can scavenge them at some point. While my frigate continues, there's also something over there, but it's just an island, and there's the guy. Oh, okay, it's just a ship. There's no island here, per se. Takes a lot to swim. All right, and we do get the research papers that we probably will need to get back up Steady here to the researches. Perfect, and there we can turn in that quest, and we probably get, yep, more down. of these herbariums out, botanical knowledge that we can use for items. Meanwhile, for the fishes, we do have a bit of a problem as some of these shoals here are out of fishes now. I hope they regenerate. I think they're going to regenerate. But for now, I need to, well, turn off That's this fishery there so it doesn't cost us any um, pollution anymore and stuff like that. This one here, I think, can still work a bit. There's still one with 130 shoals available. That seems to be quite a lot, though. But I guess it's going to work out. Then we have this one here that has a shoal, has three of them. One of them is already out, right? And then we have on the other side of the whole thing. Here, another beach with some more shoals that we can still use. And I would like to do this. So let's get a road over there. Um, by the way, let's just have a look how many of them we can have there. There's one with three. And I guess that's going to be it, right? So those three. And then the warehouse for that as well. We can afford that. We also get a bit of water quality back because I think we stopped on them here. And they should start to regenerate them again. And I think that's it though, right? We don't have any other beaches available. So I guess I need to juggle these shoals here then around my island. And there it is. The dam phase one has been completed. Let's finish this. The first phase ah, the this is looking pretty cool. A promising start. So the second phase I would need to start now. And we could already go ahead with that. We do need a few more obreros and steel beams now. Um, also, we do have now lots of honolers. So I would like to clear these ruins there. This one, by the way, takes 1 hour 40 minutes. That's insane. All right. This one here, though, is much quicker. But that is a lot of time on that for these 10 pollution that we get out of that. I would also like to go ahead and purchase us the next item. So the industrial toxin filter, this one here for the heavy industry buildings, minus 20% eco balance impact and workforce is needed plus 20% that we can afford. The eco balance, that is something that we can't afford. I can't afford uh, if it continues like that. So we need to be careful about it. Um, there we can now craft it, the toxin. And we're going to need this now for the steel beams and our brick factories and two factories. So let's go ahead and get this one over there once more. We already have the two factories here. I will now delete both of these uh, brick factories there. Um, we are, of course, going to build 
one once more, once again hear them, that we can have in the area. And I will need a trade union for these guys here too, right? Since this is going to be our heavy industry area, more or less, I definitely do want to have some filtering there as it makes sense we have one iron deposit here i do need for the steel beams however i do need a coal mine as well that is something that we probably will have there there it is and i've already placed the road over there the coal mine does not pollute anything oh thank the gods because i don't know how we could tackle this any other way there you go coal mine on its way and this one here is our second iron mine so we can already build it here or place it here Let's get rid of the lumberjack hut there. The distance is fine, I guess, for one. And then we are going to have the furnace here. That is producing every 30 seconds. So we could actually have two of them. We'll see about that. How many of them I, I'm really going to have, right? Because as always, it's all about the pollution. And here I can then activate my filter once I do you have it. There you go. Whoopsie. And now I can activate this one right away, as I should. And it's affecting those. Also affecting the mine. Yeah, should not be really happening. So we are down to minus six now only. The factory, uh, that with that, we would be positive there once more. Uh, water is also a bit down here. The fisheries are doing their job. Yeah, that's tricky. I might need another trade union for the fishery. So let's build the brick factory. That's, of course, negative once again. Of course, we are going to need to upgrade more Honor Levers there to Obrero. So let's go ahead and upgrade these rows here so that we get this workforce going. We don't need that many um, Honor Levers anyway for the moment. By the way, money really doesn't seem to be an issue here. Um, and with that, I could now go ahead and build the furnace once we have a bit more bricks in. So the brick factory is already working on that um, for the filtration. Do we have any other thing? It's only for crop farms and fisheries. And I guess we cannot stack them might be so useful um productivity and eco balance impact increased eco balance impact increased but productivity 50 percent that is at least something other than that it's not looking so great and we definitely do need now these coffee pots there as well because with them we can actually afford the forest seeds that will improve our air quality once more for that i will need a coffee plantation and we can actually have this one close to the other plantations that i already have here let's try not to take down too many uh, trees there so let's make this one in a bit of a sloppy way and as we can see it's boosting it so we do get the holy culture effect so they are not doing anything bad here oh god air quality air quality uh, it's the two factories just very bad overall i might need to turn down one of my brick factories once more and then we have the second iron mine that i'm going to need now too so we really do need those bricks and let's go ahead and build the drip coffee pot factory <laughs> That's a pretty cool here, name. Uh, we already have the iron ore in, so there's a plus one uh, influx of iron anyway. And then we have already also, we should be having some coffee. There it is, perfect coffee beans. With that, we can make the production of this one now, as uh, this is also a very valuable trade good. Yeah, and let's yet. stop it for the obreros for now, because I would like to save a couple of them for myself. All right, also over here now, we are finishing the Perforian factory. Off it goes. We do get some, well, steel beams and caoutchouc out of that. How very nice. And as we can see, air is at least regenerating once more. And that was really close to the acid rain here that is reducing the productivity of all my crop farms by 30%. Water is slightly going down. And I'm preparing something else here. We do have almost now 10 tons of drip pot coffee. Um, and we, with that, we can actually build, purchase two things. The first one would be the forester seed that I would like to go for here. That With that, we can reforest the trees. And also here, we do have the water purifier station. This is a permanent increase, I think, to my water. So as we can see, water quality impact plus 30 once this has been built with that um, blueprint that we need for it. And that's 10 tons that we have it. So let's go ahead and get both of them. And we do have six of these blueprints. We do need four. All right. So actually, we do need quite a bit of that. We can also go ahead with the next quest. Problem. We were meant to receive a shipment of indicator solution from El Cerro, but the cargo fell overboard. You honor us so again. pick up the flotsam right here. All right. Doesn't seem to be very difficult. Um, I think... What should we go first? What should we go first here? It's a bit tricky right now because air is good, but at the cost of having no brick factories working at the moment. Um, and then there's the whole thing with the next phase. So 900 Obreros is insane as a, as a cost there. 
Uh, let's go ahead with the air because I need to get my industry back up working there soon. So there we have it, the Forester Collection. Uh, there is a better one, but we can't afford that at the moment. All right, that was expensive. Please don't let me do this again. Um, and I will definitely need to do the quest here if I want to have the water purifier as well. That's that. Um, and the coffee pot, we're still going to disable that for now. And then there's the whole thing of expansion for the city. I will probably need another district here. We do have the timber. So let's go ahead and get us a few more blocks of houses up here. And I will also need another um, marketplace then, of course. And this is really something that I really don't like to do that that much. But we need to because I do need the workforce for my people. Let's also have a chapel in this area. So those people can go and pray something. Poo, 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 poo. That is close. But the chapel is there, as we can see. And of course, the fish will completely be down with that, I think. So it's at minus two now. We still have 37 tons of fish left. That is something. And then there's the water pump. This is also needed for those people here. Let's have a water pump as well. So those people have the water pump. There it is. Perfect. And from both sides there, because the other water pump is over there. Right. So that's that. Meanwhile, let's pick up the flotsam. There it is. And let's get this one over to the researcher. And we do get some herbarium back again. Perfect. This is exactly how much we need. Landslide. Recent deforestation has destabilized, destabilized the soil, causing landslides. We'll put half our honolers to work on it. Ooh, workforce minus 50%. And it does cost me 10 tools. Uh, workforce minus 50%. We'll put half our honolers to work with them without specialized tools. Uh, let's go with that. Oh, and this actually brings us to negativity there. For the time being, for 23 minutes. At least we got these blocks here ready then you once more. And let's go ahead and have... Yeah, we still need to wait now on these additional goods to come in. So the drip pot there. The tools factory is still is working. And I will need more people. So let's go ahead and have a few more honolers in this area. Ah, and there is already the next problem coming up. Your people. And that is illness. And how can I fix that with the hospital? Of course, that needs bricks. We don't have the bricks. I can make the brick factory work though again because we have a positive air income now. And even water is looking fine. But I do need that hospital there, of course. Ah, and it's a big version of it, of course. Not so easy. This is further destabilizing my... Panalero's population. Ah, fish is really, really down now. I need to do something about that. Times we have more help. I think we still have something over here. There it is. Fish. So, but only one. Could probably place it like this, right? And then have a road. Is that possible? Of course, this is not possible. For the strangest of reasons, there is a shoal here that is blocking the whole path, it seems. <laughs> and I cannot do that here. That's a shame, really. All right, now we have the forester seed. Um, I think I need to activate it. And there we have it, forester hut. We can now reforest the... Well, the forest that we have here. Um, let's just see where we have a bunch of stuff. There it is, the first one. Honolera's workforce, of course. That is not something I can afford right now. As we're getting a lot of negative impact there right now on the Honolera's. Okay, I deactivated clearing this row in there because it's just taking too much time. Anyway, we can with that have a, a one of them here. So this is now reforesting the area here, thus increasing the air quality. Let's have the next one probably, yeah, here where we already have a connection. Wait a second, I think they don't even need... I don't think they actually need the epidemic a connection to a warehouse, right? Perfect. Meanwhile, we have all the resources for our water purifier filter. There you go. It's the last of these documents that we're using with that as well. And let's get this one to the shore. And oh, no new quest. I was totally expecting a new quest here. It does cost me 50 honoleros once more, but we could afford it. And we can have it right here beside the, the warehouse. So let's do this one. Then we pass the water and this one is now increasing the water quality on the island. And look at that. It's pretty massive too. That's at least something here. Okay, the next mission actually wants us to build a jackal kiln and have it running for 10 minutes. Very interesting indeed. I don't know how or what I should here, feel Governor? about that. But there we have it. And now... Oh, we need to build two of them. Why? Are you completely serious? This seems to be... 
uh, really, really bad because we need to chop down trees again for that. And I probably will use, well, any kind of forest that we have close by. So over there we have lots of trees, as we can see. There's the second one. Unfortunately, I will we will need to do this quest. It's one of the worst ones that I've seen so far because it's also costing us 10 minutes and we need to wait these 10 minutes if we want to get the herbarium. And I do need that. Why? Because we're running out of shoals here right now. And that in return means that we need to get the aqua farm um, fish eggs here as soon as possible because I need to build me a fish farm without that uh, we cannot continue anymore because then the game is over I don't have any fish soon and we do need to get this item and we only can get it with the herbariums and we do need a lot of them six really this is all rather insane to me to be honest <laughs> so this is well it's insane Okay, quest has been finished. Let's delete the charcoal kilns there once more, as I really don't want to chop down any trees and we can make the coal mine work again, as this one is causing no pollution whatsoever. Very strange quest there indeed. Air pollution seems to be fine, so let's get the first uh, furnace cracking here. This one, so iron and coal input it needs. It is, of course, polluting the air a bit, but we should be able to afford that. This is pretty important for the dam. Um, and I might Still also activate to my second tool factory there once more, um, just in case, because I, we also need lots of these tools. This iron deposit here, by the way, is empty now. I'm working on this iron deposit there, where we're depleting it right now. Um, this coal mine is working for quite some time still. And then I think we have... Uh, um, more coal up there, but iron-wise, I think we might be running out of iron then. Interesting. Right, since the sickness is happening quite often, we will need to build a hospital. That's another 20 bricks that I have to pay there, and let's just build those obreros here to make up for the loss that we had there. So far, so good, but holy cow, that was only one thing. Landmark. And once again, we are down on the bricks, and I cannot afford to keep the furnace going for too long, because the pollution it puts out there is insane. Oh, that's pretty cool. We can actually scavenge these ruins here with our ships and we do get some materials out of that. This is actually pretty useful. There's also something here, a curious plant that we can collect. So something that I haven't done yet as well. And it seems to be a pretty good way of boosting your raw materials or building materials even. And these are some very valuable things there, right? And there's everywhere something to explore. There's also a Mesoan pyramid over there that we can also explore if we want to. So what do we get out of this one here? Effective fishery. Productivity is reduced, but for every four fish, we get one fish in addition. That Order sounds pretty interesting. I might actually activate this one on one of my fisheries. Oh, and we also get herbarium out of that. How very cool. Let's get this ship back right now because we are still not getting a quest there. And we do need that for the fish fertility or the fish seeds that we urgently, urgently need, right? And then we have the six that we need for that. Perfect. I'm also, by the way, I've opened up the drip coffee pots for my obreros to also start building up some, well, workforce there. I think we might be having enough buildings obrero-wise, but I think we need to activate more goods here um, to for the dam project. But let's get this back home. Ah, and at the same time now, there is something actually we can do. An equipment a trade union, a soil sampler, or an advanced soil sampler. Do we have any of these? Of course we don't. I need to craft this item first before I can finish this quest. Another quest that seems to be pretty hard to me because we need to invest items first before we can finish it. Soil sampler. It's for the soil, obviously. And soil sampler. There it is. And it does cost me one herbarium. So we actually invest one to get two out of it. Doesn't seem like a good trade-off there. Right, because I think it's only two. Yes, it's only two. So we are wasting basically almost one. And let's get this one now cracking. So that's the six that we need here. What else do we need? I think ten. Just see. Oh god, we really, really do need that. Ten tools and ten Aye. pots that we need in addition. Ten tools, ten pots. Let's get this one over. And by the way, by the way, there we can also do something. Uh, I don't have the space anyway. Um, we can get items there for this one here, the dynamite. Need 10 timber and one of these herbariums to refill an iron deposit. That is something we definitely will need to do as well. Let's get the fish done. There it is. Perfect. That feels good. And then we can actually go right away for this iron deposit here that we can replenish them. Because this is already dangerously low again. 
They were going down pretty quickly there overall. My steel beams, bricks, uh, meanwhile, and my tools are going up. That's important for the dam. Now that we have that item, then let's take the 10 tons of timber and the barium, get this one over, and then the ship can continue with its exploration. And meanwhile, we can now get our first fish farm going. Do I need to activate it? There it is. Perfect. Five of them I can actually get cracking. And they cost me 50 hundred hours. They actually reduce or increase the soil quality. Alright, let's get one here for now. And we do need these farms then for that. Now this seems pretty cool to be honest. Let's just see. Four and... Well, let's have the fifth one here because I might actually want to have a trade union oh, here then at some point once the chopping down is done and then we can have more of them here than in surrounding let's build the aqua farm so soil quality aqua has never really what been a problem except for the beginning the i think so that's fine for now and with that we get fish out of it oh my goodness we get fish out of that we can actually build a second one right away and i probably will do that over here so there we have we should have the space for it Ah, perfect. There it is. And let's build the second aqua farm there as well. Both of them are now working. Trade union for the future if we want to. And that's the fish. And please tell me that they're producing enough fish then. I hope so. Please. Let's get the diamond dynamite on its way. There you go. Let's get it back to our island. And then I'm going to further explore with my libadat. With my fish, um, with my frigate, right? Because we have lots of exploration out there still. And I'm really excited about this, about these ruins and stuff like that. Now with that dynamite, I can activate this one here. I think we do need to have a mine on it though. Put the mine first. And I need to activate these items there. Then we can replenish it. And there we go. Perfect. And the 50 honor levers it costs us, that's nothing. And for my Hunter levels now here, let's activate the tools so we can continue upgrading some of them. Alright, while I continue expanding my fish farms, we see each other again in the next episode. Stay tuned.